Here at the farm, we serve lunch and dinner to our guests using all the products coming from the farm. One of our favorite recipe is the beef sauce. Let me show you how to make it. The ingredients for this recipe are the celery from Amico's garden, fresh parsley, carrots, a couple of onions, garlic, extra virgin olive oil, conserva di pomodoro, tomato sauce, and ground beef. That's it. And now let's chop and mince all our ingredients. There is the way to chop the vegetable, chef style and mama style. So I want to show you with the knife, chef style. And this is mama style with the mezzaluna, the half moon. When you start to chop these ingredients and mince these ingredients, the smell that they're giving to you is incredible. Plus, is a very good workout. Means until the vegetables are very, very fine. I know this is a lot of work, so you can use a food processor, but be careful, don't overdo, otherwise you puree the vegetable. And this is not what we want. Once you have minced your fresh vegetables, Fry them until they're golden. And then chop some fresh tomato or use tomato sauce. I will use ours from the farm. So hard sometimes to get this tomato out of the bottle. They're all stuck inside. Now I'm separating the skin and the seeds from the tomato. I promise this sauce is to die for. Now that the vegetables are golden, we are going to add our ground beef. Look how lean it is. After you add the ground beef, don't forget to put the salt and the pepper. Stir your ground beef occasionally until it's brown. Then add your tomato sauce. Let the sauce boil for one hour until the liquid is reduced. When the sauce is ready, Transfer what you need to a shallow pan. Then bring a pot of water to a boil, add some salt and your homemade pasta. Make sure you only cook for three minutes. It's fresh pasta. We don't want it overcooked. Once the pasta is cooked, toast with your beef sauce. Easy and delicious. Salute!